Okay, we're rolling. Eric, lead the way. Okay, we're going to stay away from the right. That's an uh, unsafe tunnel. We're going to stay on the left. Oh yeah. All the way down. If we had better lights, this is all super sparkly. So did I hear you correctly earlier that this is really geothermal in in origin? Uh, the depositation, but the, the we're actually on the Fredrickson fault. There's a major pretty major earthquake fault. And there is also some volcanic activity here. So that's why I understand why we have such a great abundance of mineral diversity. 23 feet from the We're going to come up here. There's a vertical shaft on the left, so we're going to stay to the right. And How deep is that shaft? Uh, that one's not which one, the one I told you to be careful of. Yeah. Uh, it's not very deep, but you don't want to fall on it. There is a real deep one, I'll show you. Look right here, look at that. Ooh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're gonna come up here. We're gonna watch, we wanna stay on the right, okay? That's good, that's a little bit cool. But as you can see, it's much more comfortable down here. They can work even in the summer. Yeah. This is the main work. I'm glad I wore boots. You want to go down? If you do, uh, there's you could go through that tunnel. You could use that rail as a ladder. Or nah, I'm good. This. Um, <clears throat> This is a, a perfect perch to see what the heck's yeah, going this on. this is the ma major works. So you're pretty much seeing it. So is this something hard, or is this something left structurally for mine support, this feature here? I, I don't know. I know that they were digging out of the ceiling. Okay. So this was dug out, as far as I know. This isn't like a natural cave. Right. So they dug in and then down. So does this go to that shaft? This is an ore lift, and there was a rail there. Okay. And then there's a chute over there that, that's running off the stope, and then uh, there's deeper tunnels, like another uh, another hundred feet down that run quite a ways. But it's not a major works; it's mostly tunnel. But the entire ceiling is like a sheet of copper. Wow. Yeah. That's something else. And then there's an unexplored vertical shaft that also has an ore lift that you could see, but it, it's going to be a major uh, caving like operation. And we actually had it on the books with a professional caving team that mapped a whole bunch of caves for the government of the Dominican Republic. But Heather broke her leg, and so we decided to put it off. I can see some of those nails you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be careful. That's, these old timbers got rusty nails, and sometimes they're right where you'd want to sit. <laughs> you uh huh. Wow, it's pretty amazing how far we came down. I just didn't even realize that. Wow, something else. So tell me about that arrow, that arrow on the wall. Oh, uh, that goes to uh, another set of tunnels. So there's some numbers, um, actually. That, I think, is the way to technically exit from down here, not up here. You could go around the corner. Okay. And then there was another run that went down that big slope we were coming. There was a lift there, too, so they would take material both ways. Remarkable. And then there's a series of numbers. Those correspond to the survey, so you'll see, like, 47, 22. Okay. And there's a lot of stuff in UV reactive paint. So when you're down here, you see all kinds of numbers you don't see when the, in the ordinary light. Interesting. I borrowed a UV flashlight um, for scorpions. 
And I found one in the Black Rock Desert when I was uh, a tiny little baby dead one. But I just was really limited to uh, how much I could put in a backpack and not have to pay Spirit Airlines a fee. Yeah. All sorts of sparkly stuff here. Oh my gosh. Yeah, if you go down lower, there's like quite a bit of like in the ceiling. And actually down there is where you hit it with the black light. It looks like you're in outer space. Really? Yeah, everything just looks like like looks like, like deep space, like the Hubble deep field or something. So yeah, that goes all the way down like another hundred some feet. And then there's those tunnels I told you about. Wow. There's a, there's a, I think we have 1,200 feet of tunnel total. There's a bunch of side, side shoots off of this main slope. That's something else. Yeah. And it's just the thought of getting out here without a vehicle well, is mind yeah. bending. And, and then, the fact that Latin Nevada Fell relocated an irrigated rail from the El Dorado mine, which is actually I'd only recently discovered it came from a different mine. In the literature, it said the El Dorado mine, but it was actually the Quartet mine, which is another one that we work. So it's strange. It's strange that the railroad got moved from one mine that we work to another mine that we work. We can't claim that one, so we just keep it a secret. We got a few Safani secret dig spots that we <laughs> take people to. I'm going to yield the flashlight back to you. Mm -hmm.